laptop for schools project is a government project. We are all involved in it. Now the question is how are we going to connect the dots? I want to walk uh, through this uh, very carefully because these are issues that many of you are very well aware of. Our first challenge as a ministry and our first responsibility is to ensure that we have provided uh, the requisite infrastructure to be able to move data to uh, the fastest ends possible and this can only be done through the fiber optic cables that are being laid. Through North B1 as you know, we've done about 5,000 uh, kilometers and North B2 is supposed to do another 5,000 kilometers and that way we will probably have about 10,000 uh, uh, you know, kilometers of fiber laid uh, and, and much, uh, uh, much of this cable is terminating uh, you know, at the, the uh, county headquarters, which means it's easier to move it from there, uh, uh, you know, to, to other places. And as you know, there are eight companies, eight private uh, investors who are also laying, uh, you know, fiber across the country. The question is, do we have the infrastructure that will carry the data? Yes. The next question is about, uh, uh, you know, migration uh, from, you know, uh, analog to, to digital. I am actually debating in my mind whether I should answer this question because, as you know, there is a matter in court. Uh, COFEC has, uh, you know, taken the CCK to court uh, on this issue of uh, uh, migration. And 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 uh, you know, you are smart people. You understand what the law is. I don't want to uh, behave in a manner that prejudices uh, the decision of the court. But if that problem was solved and if we actually surmounted that issue, we will be able to migrate very easily. And what will happen is that we could very easily free uh, you know, a sufficient spectrum to migrate our platform from 3G to 4G. And, and sometimes, you know, when colleagues, when people think about a, a, a laptop for schools and how you're going to move content around, they forget that, you know, you can actually optimize educational content and use the mobile phone. On the question of, um, uh, you know, uh, the set of boxes and digital migration, as soon as we address this issue that is in court, uh, I would be more than willing to get around with colleagues uh, in the media and elsewhere to have discussions on how we, we have so many ideas. I mean, I had a meeting yesterday with the ICT board, I mean, with the board of the CCK, and we have so many ideas and we believe we have the solution on how we are going to be able to migrate very easily. The question is, as you understand, fellow Kenyans, we have also become an interesting society. We go to court for everything. Even issues where we can actually sit down and agree. I'm not saying people don't have a right to go to court. They can go to court, yes. But sometimes we should also use other mechanisms, including discussion, including ventilating our differences. Where we have certain policy disagreements, we don't have to go to court and wait to be heard for six, seven months, and we delay implementation of policy. We can actually sit around the table. Because after all, we are all Kenyans. I mean, we, we, we are not going, government will not do things that will hurt Kenyan people. And if you want us to see a perspective we cannot see, we are ready and willing to see it. The question is, we should always think about the country and the development of the country. Because when you decide you are going to ventilate an issue uh, in the court, including issues we can actually sit around the table and negotiate and discuss and see your point of view. It, it, and you, you delay everyone. So the question is, I would like to answer uh, uh, my sister up there. Very robustly, we have so many ideas and I can assure you, we are on top of it. If we sorted that matter out in court, I would like us to have a round table and we will tell you what we are thinking about providing set of boxes and I would like us to migrate because you all understand the digital dividend that will come from that end of migration. But at the moment, there isn't much you can say. Thank you.